Facts. All right, we're number eight. Number eight. It used to be much harder and cost more to purchase stocks. So why did we throw this one in there? We threw this one in there so people who are younger may not know this. I, I don't really hear this being talked about it much anymore, but because of Robinhood and because of Acorn and these different apps, yes, yeah, like we just said, it's super easy to get in. Now, going back to Stu's comment about what can you do to kind of uh, – Hedge, right? The one of the wait, 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 that, wait. I'm sorry, Eric. I'm sorry. You threw a word out there that most people is not a common word. Oh, okay. I never, well, I never well, used that word. Question, or, or, or yeah, I never used that word. The my okay. question was, you know, are there side bets? Side bets, okay. And then you use the term good. hedge. Okay, so oh, let's get we don't get into that now. So. Hey, I'm using the word hedge, which is just another word for you could use it to say side betting or you could use it to what's the way I can use, say this word? Uh, make an assurance that you're going to be OK. All right. Is, is, is hedge, would you say a hedge is like leverage? Yeah, but that leverage is a loaded term in the financial world. OK. That means a lot of different stuff because it can mean debt. It can mean like you're borrowing. It can mean a lot of stuff. So I would rather just say you're trying to make sure you're going to be all right. All right. Yeah, like that. Okay. So and then now this goes back to our number eight. So one of the things that you can do so much easier now because of technology is trade options. Options is a way to sort of side bet. And it takes some analysis, right? So let's go back to we were talking about Ralph Lauren a little bit earlier. Say, so we always assume that the conversation is just going to be, if I buy Ralph Lauren, is it going to go up or not? That's one conversation, but it's not the only conversation that you can have. Another conversation that you can have is, is I think Ralph Lauren is going to go down. So I don't know if a lot of people knew this, but you can bet against the stock. You know, you, I'm using the word bet because, again, we're, we don't know what the market is going to do. But, like, you can determine in your analysis that the stock is going to go down and not up. And so now, even in these apps like Robinhood and other apps, you can go in and purchase some options that are basically saying, I think it's going to go down at this price during this time frame. And you don't have to go through a broker. You don't have to talk to anybody on the phone, none of that. You can do that right there on your phone. And that's a fantastic thing to be able to do. Yeah. Now, going back to your side bet again, another thing that you can do, and this gets kind of sophisticated at times, but it's like you could have a position on a stock and then take a, a different position on the same stock. So you might own a Ralph Lauren stock and then also be side betting with an option saying, well, I, but I still think it's going to go down. So I'm going to do this other trade over here just in case so I can limit my exposure. So it's like, yeah, I feel good about it, but I still think it might go down. So I'm going to put my place this trade over here. Those are some of the ways that people side bet. And it gets really, really minute because there's so many different things that you can do. You can play with the time frames and all this different stuff, but options are a way to side bet and also bet against a company. So uh, limits, stops, those are kinds of options? Limits and stops are, are types of orders that you can make. Okay, but an option is the bet uh, on, you can, you can profit on the company losing money. Yeah, they, they get into things. I don't want to get too technical. Calls, and yeah, yeah. calls and puts or something that everybody should. Oh yeah, uh, Latoya's our. She's oh, our. Latoya got it. Applying a call or put. Yeah, so a call or put. Research calls and puts, but those are the the types of orders that you can, the types of options that you can buy depending on what you think is going to happen, what you think is going to, or how much you want to limit your risk on a specific position or shares that you own. So yeah, those are ways to side bet. Now, I, but out of this conversation, the main thing that I want people to know is not so much the side betting. I want people to understand that you can bet against a stock. 
I just think that's important to understand that's because dope. I always just hear, well, I don't know if it's going to go. You know, I don't want to purchase this because I think I don't think it's going to go up. Great. You don't think Coca-Cola is going to go up? Bet against it. Right. You can do that. That's dope. So just to your app, and one thing about Robinhood specifically, they break down what all these different things are in detail in the app and the consequences of you doing this. And if you do this, how much would you potentially lose? They get really granular so you could really understand what you're doing. To be informed, we want you to be informed.